Julia. Well, 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 hey, Billy Bob. So, what you got there? Well, what does it look like? Hmm. Are you going hiking? No, silly. It's my backpack for school. You know, school where we go ah, learn things. Yeah. School. Wait, wait. School? Yes. School. Oh. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You love school. What are you talking about? You love school. Well, aren't, aren't you scared about like the whole virus thingy and the, and the, the social distancing? Big word. Yes, that is a big word, and and I'll probably hear some people talk about it at school tomorrow. But, you know, yeah, I am kind of a little bit afraid, but, you know, I got my mask, and, and I got my backpack, and, you know, the teachers and the principals and everybody have been working really hard to, to do things for us at school to keep us safe, and, and I, I'm actually kind of excited. I get to see my friends and, and my teachers and, and, and get to see everybody. I won't be able to hug everybody, but I can kind of give them a... Uh, an elbow, um, elbow touch, and just and just say hey to them. So I'm excited. But you know what? Now that you talk about being afraid, that kind of reminds me of a Bible story. You want to hear a Bible story? Oh sure, I love those. Well, so in Matthew 14, there's a story about Jesus and the disciples. And it was right after Jesus had been preaching to the multitudes. That means like a bunch, a bunch of people. And he was really tired. That's right, another big word. And he was really, really tired. So he wanted the disciples to get into the boat and take him across to the other side where there was a mountain where he could get out and he could rest and he could do some praying. So they did that. They got into the boat. But after Jesus got out, all of a sudden a storm came up. And the winds were blowing and the waves got really big and the boat was tossing back and forth and back and forth and and the disciples got kind of scared and all of a sudden Jesus saw there was a storm going on and he saw that the boat had gone out into the middle of the lake and so he started walking on the water Wait. And he, yeah Jesus was walking on the water. It's one of the miracles in the Bible. And Peter saw him walking. And he was, and they were amazed. They couldn't believe Jesus was walking on the water. And so Jesus said, Peter, come out to me. And so Peter got out of the boat. But then all of a sudden the waves started tossing and turning again. And Peter got really scared. And so he started drowning and he started sinking into the water. And Jesus said, Peter, why do you doubt me? And he said, help me, Lord, help me, Lord. And so Jesus stretched out his hand and grabbed Peter and pulled him up. And they got into the boat. Isn't that a cool story? Wow. I know. And so, you know, Peter was afraid. But we shouldn't be afraid when we have Jesus around us. Because you know what? Jesus is going to take care of us no matter what. So even when there's waves tossing to and fro and there's a virus that's making people sick and there's always all kinds of things going on, we know that Jesus is going to take really good care of us. And he's got our back. So, yeah, on one hand, I'm a little afraid, but on the other hand, I'm not afraid, afraid at all because I know Jesus is going to be with me tomorrow at school. Wow, I guess you're right. So, is Jesus going to be with you at school tomorrow, too? Yep. <laughs> he sure is. So, boys and girls out there, we want to do something a little special. We want to have a blessing of the backpacks. So, if you have your backpack ready to go to school, we want you to go run and get it real quick. So, if you have to pause this video, go get your backpack and bring it back to whatever you're watching. If you're watching the TV or on a, on a, a tablet or... A, a computer go get it really quick and come back we'll wait yep we'll be right here
Okay, I bet they're back by now, don't you think? Because I bet these kids run really, really fast. I think so. Yeah. All right, so everybody, bow your heads. Okay. Dear Jesus, thank you for the story of Matthew and in Matthew about Peter and, and you on the boat. Thank you for making us not afraid. Thank you for being there for us and taking care of us no matter what. And Lord, I just pray that you would keep us this week as we go to school. Keep us safe and keep us healthy and keep us strong. Help us to follow the rules. And Lord, bless the teachers and the nurses and the cafeteria workers and the principals and the custodians and everybody who takes care of us and does everything in the schools to keep us safe and healthy so we could be there. And we just pray these things in your name. Amen. Amen. All right, everybody have a great week. Your first week at school. I know it'll be a little bit different. You might only go to school maybe a couple of days this week and then have to be on the computer, but you know, that's what we have to do right now. That's what we have to do. So we'll see you next week. Have a good week. Bye. Bye.